What's up guys, Disturb Gaming here and I'm back. I've just unlocked the other two machines. So we're gonna... Okay, maybe not. <laughs> that one's locked. Let's try this other one over here. Okay, this one's unlocked. Cool. So let's try this one then. In System Cracker, collect a... Okay, that went too fast. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here's the side scrolling shoot 'em up, like I said. Keep shooting there, come on. Loads of points. Ah, okay. That's pretty cool. So the more of these gold things you collect, the more powered up your shot becomes. It's pretty sweet. Level 7 already. <laughs> this is pretty cool. It's getting a bit hectic now, but it's pretty sweet. <laughs> nice. So we'll do another couple of these, and then, oh well, one more, and then we'll see if that third one's unlocked. And if it hasn't, oh, we'll just pause the video instead of doing a brand new video. I'll just pause it and then we'll come back. Okay, so let's try this second one. That was quite cool, that first level. Um, it's definitely more difficult than that first game. Um, I think probably because it's the screen's constantly moving, that's why. Oh, damn it. What is this? Oh, grenade. R1 to use grenades. Ooh. <laughs> okay, I'm quite bad at this. Whoa. Yeah, this is definitely a lot more difficult than the first one. Maybe I'm just bad at these kind of side scrolling shoot maps. <laughs> but definitely seems harder. Points, 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 points. <laughs> I will take that. I don't know how many slime masks I've got. But there's, there's five on every level. Okay, so those those red ones instantly level you up. Good to know. I haven't really noticed how many I need to uh, level up normally with these with the gold ones, but yeah, cool. Okay, so let's see if this um, this third one's unlocked. Ah, uh, no, I didn't get all the slime masks. Oh well. Not that big a deal, really. But one, as you've obviously seen, I've been collecting coins, and what you can do with these coins is go to a, a place to unlock prizes. I don't know what exactly these prizes do, here we are, let's just have a look quick. Oh, I've already unlocked all this stuff. Ah, okay. So I don't actually spend it. Sly Cooper coin? A bottle? Bunch of stuff. 
Huh. Okay. So let's go to this other one. No, this one's locked. So what I'm going to do is... <laughs> Gotta collect them all. <laughs> uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video here. And we will be back in a second with this arcade game. So I'll see you then. What's up guys, I'm back. And it looks like there's actually four arcade machines. Not three like I first thought. Um, so let's have a look and see what this one is. I really don't know what this is going to be. Automated shutdown started. I need to reach the central port before that happens. Okay. Motion control sensors Oh, okay. This is all to do with the, yeah. This is all to do with the motion. Which is not good because, as we all know, motion controls suck. Especially when it. when you have to do it and you can't use the analog sticks. Well, this is quite annoying. Okay, this is going to be the most difficult one to get all the coins for. Especially if. You know, you can't actually... At least they're quite short, right, anyway. <laughs> um, yeah, it's going to be the most annoying, especially if you can't... If you can't uh, switch to the... To, a, to you know, just using the analog stick. Let me... Options. Can I actually switch it? No, I can't. Great. So let's just do one more of these and then we'll uh Oh what oh. <laughs> I didn't even notice there was a hole there. Let's try that again. don't care about the sly stuff, let's just try and get to the end. Whoa! Oh no, oh my god, this is really going to be difficult with motion controls. There's holes all over the place. <laughs> okay, so that's the second one done. I'm not doing any of those. Not on video anyway. These are definitely be the last thing I actually do when it comes to trying to complete this game fully. Okay, so that is that. So maybe... Well, look, there's three sets of coins there, so maybe there are only three games, and that other one's... Maybe, it, maybe that's the online leaderboard, that other machine. Um, I don't know. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pause this again quick. And um I'll have to unlock this. Well, this isn't available. Yeah, yet. it didn't it didn't tell you what it actually is. I'm gonna pause this quick and we are gonna come back once I've enabled uh internet connection and we'll see if it unlocks and says it's a leaderboard. What's up guys, I'm back and as you can see it's still locked. So I don't know this. what I have to do to unlock that. Um before I thought I may have to get a certain amount of coins, like I had to do for these other two uh, machines, but that doesn't appear to be the case, because I have 116 coins at the moment. As you can see, I have one and a half of the uh, bookcases, shelf things, um, all unlocked, so it can't be that. Then I thought maybe it's um, a two-player only game, so I turned on my second c controller, and it still didn't unlock. So, the only thing I can guess at is that you have to get every single coin in all the games to um, to unlock it. That's the only thing I can think of. Um, so, I can't bring you that. <laughs> Not yet, anyway. Until until I've got, uh, got all the coins. Um, if that is how you unlock it, anyway. So... That has been Bentley's Hack Pack. Hope you enjoyed the two videos. Um, I know it went on 
for <laughs> four or two videos. Um, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway. Uh, the game's definitely great. You really should buy it for, you know, like I said at the beginning, it's, it's 160 I think, £1.60 in the UK and probably about $3 in the US. So for that, that price, you really can't go wrong with this. Um, so, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. You all should go get this because it's really cheap, really fun to play, and it has trophies. And yeah, hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time.